say that I fuck with you, we gon' ride to the end. If I say that I fuck with you, man, we deeper than friends. If I say that I fuck with you, we gon' battle the win. If I say that I fuck with you, then that mean I'm all in. If I say that I fuck with you, we gon' ride to the end. If I say that I fuck with you, we gon' battle the win. If I say that I fuck with you, we gon' ride to the end. What's up, YouTube? You seen that red What's up, y'all? We, uh. So today, we're coming with a mug thing. Oh, I have a question. Oh, well, you ain't gotta ask no questions. Okay. So today we, uh, well, we got a little surprise for y'all. I mean, we can't tell y'all what we really did today. Mm hmm but it's definitely coming. But we just wanted to come on and I don't know, just talk. We wasn't do questions, but my phone is propped up. We went to this wing place. And wait, can y'all see it? I already ate a wing. I got sweet chili and hot. I got I got hot wings and, and barbecue wings, you know. I will show y'all my wing. I'll show y'all a wing, you know. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> Anyway, so today has been a good day overall. We slept in. Mm-hmm. All weekend. Well, they slept in. I had to get up yesterday to go get a haircut. <laughs> then the day. He wake up early because he in the military, so he used to that. So I woke up and started watching YouTube today. And he do that every morning. And it's so crazy because he complained about going to PT. And then on weekends, he wake up at the crack a of dawn. And I don't know. He just used to that now. So On the weekend, I don't mind because I can always just go back to sleep if I wanted to. But I think he's just so accustomed to waking up early that that's just his body is like, wake up, wake up. But me, I'm going to sleep in till 11, 12 o'clock, and I ain't going to care. Maybe even three. <laughs> um, mm -mm. I do not sleep in that late. You wrong for saying that. You don't sleep in that late? No, I sleep in like, well, I wake up. Hmm. We just left the house at like two. But I wasn't asleep. Her and that little baby back there was home. No, we wasn't. I woke up at like, because I be tired. Like, well, so now LJ is sleeping a full night. So it's really not as bad as it was because he'll wake up at like at eight o'clock, sometimes six o'clock in the morning and he'll be one in a bottle. But for the most part, he sleep through the night. So it's not as bad, but I still be tired. Like, I don't know, but I'm starting school tomorrow. So I'm definitely not gonna be able to sleep in as much as I want to because I have to go to class now so i just been enjoying my little freedom like while well, i took a little break from schools ever since i had um uh, lj so mm -hmm. oh so when he was first born i wanted to take him back to the hospital because <laughs> man he was getting on our nerves when i say no sleep no reason at all no sleep Go to sleep at nine. You wake up at ten. Mm -hmm. Go to sleep at ten. You wake up at ten fifteen. And you know what's so crazy? Because we used to literally go to sleep at like twelve o'clock in the morning, and we used to be like, "Dang, LJ finna wake up any minute now." And we used to be mad, knowing we know he gonna wake up at that time. Like, of course, go to sleep earlier. But after I had LJ, my sleeping schedule was messed up. Right now, it's really not as bad as how. It was when I first had him. Cause remember I used to be waking up at like three, four o'clock in the afternoon. Like I was sleeping when he slept because, and then I was breastfeeding, so. Yeah. Yeah, LJ, uh, LJ sleep schedule got a lot better though. I did. But she was getting on my nerves, man. But when he get old enough, <clears throat> he's definitely gonna be on punishment. He's been on punishment since he's been in the womb. I promise you. Mm -hmm. Not ever since he been in the room. I put him on punishment since he been born. I mean, he still get his weekends sometimes. Wait, are you sick? 
No, actually, I'm not sick. I was sick a couple weeks ago, though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was sick a couple weeks ago. I felt so bad. No, I'm saying in the mind. I had a headache, you know. Headache, sore throat. But my head not really sick. So we recently took a trip to Houston, and he was so sick today that so we drove. It was like 16 hours, and. He felt so bad the day that we were supposed to leave. I drove like three hours. Four yes. hours like uh, he and him and knowing him, he likes driving. So him only driving them few hours, like that's like a red flag because he likes driving. But he was so sick. So I took over and drove the whole way. Yeah. So we was going to record while we was in Houston. But I couldn't find a camera charger. Mm. And somebody didn't help me. Because you never even told me that she was looking for it. And then, you know, we was rushing the day before. We literally packed the day before we left. <laughs> literally. The day that we were was leaving, pretty much. Yeah, basically. Like, Ooh, we last minute. We, la know. we last minute with everything. Ooh. This is better. I'm glowing. <laughs> the skin. You are so lame. Like you said. <laughs> mm. So I was scared. That's what she wanted to say. Mm -mm. I was scared to give this place a trial. Because I'm the type of person that be looking at reviews. And if your reviews is bad. Mm -mm. Yeah, so they had a, a 2.5 rating. But you know. Just because the rating bad don't mean the place is bad. Yes, it does. Because if you got all these reviews and everybody's saying the same thing, then something must be wrong for real. Okay, then in the comments, can y'all comment and say, why are you eating it then? <laughs> Look, at it, you already know that if we if we see something in our bad rating, we be looking at it kind of lopsided. Like, our second... Because I'm the type of person... I'll be wanting to try new stuff, but I just can't help it. Like, I need to know. And, like, as soon as I try something new, I don't like it. Like, so I be trying to read reviews because I'm just like, okay, let me see. And it's so crazy because after I eat something new, I'll go back and look at the reviews. And it be the exact same thing that other people were saying that I didn't like the food. So that's why I try to read the reviews before I try something different. Because who want to be wasting money for no reason? Not me. So, <clears throat> she literally get the same thing. Oh my God, Mr. Burger Man, y'all. Yeah, I get burgers everywhere we go, but okay. So I like the burgers, so I eat the burgers. She tries something new and never likes it mm -hmm. at all. You wrong. I like a few stuff. Like what? Like <laughs> now she don't remember. She don't remember now. She's no. gonna say something like, I like the fries. I tried the fries for the first time. What did I eat for the first time and I like that? Let's see. Mm -hmm. I think North Carolina food is trash. That's just my opinion. Of course. It is my opinion. I mean, I don't know. They don't really be having no good food out here. I'm from the city, I'm from Houston. So just imagine going from that. Then. When I went into the military, I went to Colorado. Colorado food was like they had some good places, but it wasn't like compared to Houston. So like you gotta see where I'm coming from, man. Like, so I, I guess I just expect the worst. But, mm. No, she just she just like to see fifty people per <laughs> table <laughs> that just spread COVID. Everybody at the table got. Don't even make sense because that's not exactly what I'm trying to say. I just been wanting to see good reviews because reviews because because just like okay so it was this wax center by our house european wax center and i normally go to another lady in wilson where my husband is from to get my wax but me didn't want to drive that far and all this other stuff i said i'm gonna find somebody new to go to in fairville so i shot the wax center because my mom goes to him whatever i hated it 
and I took the time I don't normally write reviews but that's how bad my wax was like I took the time out to write a review against that lady so I'm feeling like if somebody took the time out to write this review then it must really be that bad like come on now like that's how I be thinking you know some people so did it have a good review or a bad review before you went they had a good review yeah. but no but I seen a few people that had bad reviews on there though. Mm, I don't know. She just proved my point. Shut up. No, I didn't. But yeah. Just because it's a bad review don't mean it's a bad place. Okay, whatever. Because the way she eating these wings right now. <laughs> I'm telling these. Uh, they're really good. They're just small though. Yeah, they are small. Like, I thought American Deli was small. These wings are small, small. Mm -hmm. Oh, and comment down below if y'all tried those wings from Taco Bell. I know. I, I see. So, when you had to, so he had told me that Taco Bell had wings. I'm like, what? And then I seen it on Facebook. And I was looking at the comments, and people were saying that they was actually good. But I just can't imagine, like, Taco Bell making wings like I just feel like it's gonna take like a taco. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uncle Will. Well. But I seen something on Facebook. They said um, it's crazy how Taco Bell got wings and it's less squirrels now. <laughs> he was lame. <laughs> I don't get it. Like, chicken, they're using squirrels. Oh, but I never heard of the squirrel, squirrels going missing. <laughs> Not going missing. Mm. Anyway, I'm kind of bittersweet about school because I haven't been in school since I had LJ. Since before, no, after I had LJ because I was still taking one class. So I'm kind of nervous, like. I don't know how it's gonna be. I don't know. I'm not nervous. Oh, and his class start a day after mine. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, my class, I gotta, um. What class is you taking? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I'm taking a, uh, taking chemistry. You lying. <laughs> I'm taking a, uh, oral, it's like a speech class. Like oh. public, it's like public speaking. Yeah, you did tell me that you had to um, um do a like a recording or something. In front of two adults. Mm -hmm. I don't know what I got to talk about, but I got to talk. So we hold college students stop playing with us. Like, mm -mm. we working towards his degree, right, babe? <laughs> I'm, I'm pointing. No, you're not. One thing about Lange, he gonna talk. But he gonna always pull through at the end. I hate school though. He do. Then I be trying to play 2K and I got homework. Like. This boy literally will, if he got an assignment to do, get on 2K, have his laptop, and type like two words and then go back to playing the game. Every little break he have. But I passed that class with an A. Mm-hmm. He did. With no help. Well, mostly oh, no help. You know what? See, you mostly see how people no do. Nah, nah. Uh -uh. She didn't like helping me. Cause he think that I'm supposed to do his home, like homework and stuff for him. Like if he put his mind to it, he can. Like he's smart. Like he's really smart. He just want me to do it because he lazy. Or because she she is better at typing words than me. I type no, the not. way I talk. Like, yeah, I know you just didn't say that. Talking about how country I am. You can't pronounce nothing. Didn't you say that? That's not being country. You just can't talk. But you don't type how you talk. You probably can't pronounce the words you type in. <laughs> but you can. <laughs> don't ever play with my intelligence. She's smart. See? See how she said intelligence? <laughs> what? Was that wrong? Say it again. Intelligence. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 
it's another word I can't say. Like, I have, like, a problem, like, saying, I don't know why. I just have, a like, a problem saying big words. Like, that's how, like, my whole family is, kind of. Not my whole family. I would say I get it from my mama, my granny. Hmm. I just certain stuff I can't say. Don't be talking because I see you from the corner of my eye. Thank but anyway. Thank I don't know. It's just like, it's just certain stuff I can't say. And I'm not ashamed of it. I never forget where I come from. I'm going to talk like a white boy now. Other people in Houston. When talk. I first met him, he talked country. Like, I used to be like, what is he saying? Now he's been in the military so long. He lost his accent. I never had an accent. All right, Shug. You never heard me say nothing. I know. Never in my life. <laughs> Shook. That word is so funny to me. Yeah, and they like so behind on the lingo in Houston. No, we're not. Like, they're behind on everything. Y'all, he be hating, man. Like, they just started saying gang and, you know, stuff like that. No, we did not. He know he love Houston. I don't know why he be trying to front, man. He be trying to front on my city, like. I ain't saying I'm like Houston. I'm just saying y'all behind on lingo. We definitely not. This is the one person you seen that was behind on lingo. Don't try to. Mm mm. Cause I be saying all the up to date lingo. There you go. Okay, what's something I don't say? Gang. You say gang now. Just started saying that. When I say gang, I never say gang. You just said it twice. But. <laughs> <laughs> You're so annoying. But anyway, y'all. We just want to come on here. Do a little mukbang. Yeah, but we, uh, well, I'm finished, so. <laughs> Damn, you ate all them 10 wings, big boy? I go to the gym. <laughs> Let me tell y'all about that. I go to the gym, you know. No, he don't. Me and my son do abs. No, he don't. Three. Well, he do. He have been doing abs and push-ups at home, but we plan on getting, like, another gym membership one day. You know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he right. But, but yeah, y'all see, y'all have seen a couple. How long? Mm -hmm. Some months. Yeah, a couple months. No, no set time period. I know. But one day. And you know how we know that? Reviews. You know, so the reviews I got um, from other people were good, so. But yeah. um, It was great doing this video. And. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Period. And we got new um content coming like yeah we got a lot more us. content we're gonna uh be more consistent for you i know we know. haven't been really consistent because it's like kind of hard dealing with a newborn then work then school so we just got a whole bunch but 2020 year it's 2020 told you what i tell you <laughs> 2022 is our year, year. But, that's what know, i want you know what i want to say 2020 year he always make him shut our, up okay bye she was Peace gonna out, say 2022 2020 year is our 22. <laughs> But all right, we'll see y'all later, man. Bye, y'all. Said I fuck with you, we gon' ride to the end. If I say that I fuck with you, man, we deeper than friends. If I say that I fuck with you, we gon' battle the win. If I say that I fuck with you, then.